Uh, we're playing New Vegas. We're doing the Walt uh, Challenge Run. <clears throat> I've been dinking around with my... <clears throat> my goodness. I've been dinking around with my uh, setup here. So give me a second and let me see if I got it working. While we do that, let everyone file in if anyone's While showing up. That, uh, you know what? I needed to change the live notification too. Forgot to do that. I have to put it on my list of to do things to do. Uh, let's, uh, let's recap real quick. What did we do last time? Uh, Blank here. Usually I watch my my VODs the next morning. I didn't uh, I didn't do it last or this morning. I didn't have time. Uh, oh you know what? No. Yeah, no, we got the bomber. We helped the bombers. That's or the boomers. That's what we did. And I think that's all we did. Because of course that always takes like an hour to do. Let's go ahead and get started. Oh yeah, that's right. Okay, so yeah, we killed uh, we killed House last time using explosives, uh, and then we loaded Yes Man's software up into the uh, up into this bitch. Step closer to the demonstration area, please. Okay, so you're familiar with Securitrons by now, obviously. I mean, some of your best friends are Securitrons, right? <laughs> Our titanium alloy housing does a good job for protecting our delicate electronic insides from small arms fire and shrapnel. Our left arm contains an X-25 Gatling laser, quite deadly against soft targets in medium range. That looks like fun. And for close-range suppression and crowd control, we have this handy-dandy 9mm submachine gun. Nice. All of this is old hat, right? Here is where it gets interesting. Turns out that those are our secondary weapons. All this time, we've been running the Mark I think yes system, does a better which job, doesn't uh... have drivers for our primary weapons. Better Imagine. job uh, talking about this than uh, House did. Now I'm more this. interested in this. I'm one. downloading the Mark II OS to all Securitrons on the network. It makes quite a difference. With the M235 missile launcher, we can engage ground and air weapons at long range. And a rapid fire G28 grenade launching system makes us deadly in close range engagements. Woo! Look at that! The OS upgrade also includes drivers for our onboard auto repair systems. Just try to hurt us now! Altogether, this software upgrade confers a 235% increase in combat effectiveness per unit. New Vegas finally has soldiers worthy of protecting it. I hope you enjoyed this demonstration. You can come back up and see me or be on your way. I know you're a busy person. Alright, that wasn't too bad. Oh, we couldn't stick around to, to do anything else, though. That's unfortunate. Uh, so, I've made an executive decision. I know I didn't want to do any DLC, but uh, I think that I kind of want to do some DLC now, and I think I'm just I'm going to do Enjoy all, all the Vegas Strip has to offer. Uh, hold on, I'm not done talking to House yet, though. So we'll figure out we'll figure out which one we do here in a minute. An entire army of upgraded Securitrons just standing by over at the fort. Pretty neat, huh? Uh, every Securitron on the network has the Securitrons at the fort are on standby. Oh yeah, yeah, I have to talk about the tribes. Really? Talk about diplomatic skills. That's one... Uh... Yeah. Oh. 
Yeah, because we're not putting any of the effort into the other ones. You did a super job wrapping things up, and I'm not just saying that because I have to. Here's some big news. I decoded a military radio transmission, and it turns out the NCR president, Aaron Kimball, is going to visit Hoover Dam. Thank you, device, uh, so. I guess he wants to boost the trip's morale. But according to projections Mr. House made, he has an 83.75% chance of being assassinated. Whoops. Anyway, it looks like Mr. House thought it was important to keep President Kimball alive. Uh, I need that gone. Would you please go away? Dismiss. I go away. There you go. So our goal is, I think we want to kill Kimball because he's a major faction leader. Uh, and we gotta kill Kaiser still. Mr. House ran projections on how the NCR public will react to a defeat at Hoover Dam. Overwhelmingly, they'll blame Kimball. But if Kimball dies at Hoover Dam, there's no obvious scapegoat for them to blame, so they'll blame New Vegas instead. So that means reduced tourism for up to five years. The equations are pretty complicated. Mr. House sure liked numbers. Uh, I don't... I don't care what happens to Kimball. Fine by me. We've got more important things to take care of. This gadget. Oh, I thought we were going to be given an opportunity to do a quest for Mr. that. Mr. House had Man, two I'm of really these made years now. and years ago. Just like him to think ahead. Take the module to the El Dorado substation and attach it to the power control terminal. I'll handle the rest. Uh. Okay. Great. When this is taken care of, we'll be all set for the Legion to make its move. Oh, I've been shunned by the Caesar's Legion. Oh, what a shame. Alright, whatever. Keeping on. Render unt. It got stuck there for a second, you saw it. Enjoy your time. Get out of here. Let me head down to the casino. Also, I'm gonna, I'm gonna check my audio one more time. I just don't trust it. Also, I'm gonna, I'm gonna check my audio one more time. I just don't trust it. Okay. We're good. Boy, I sure did just fail a ton of quests, didn't I? We didn't do anything for uh, Caesar, I don't think. Save the game. Uh, that's bringing my vibe down. Save the game real quick and uh, where do we go from here? Okay, so we can go down to the El Dorado Power Station, which is the. Uh, that's the spot over there by the. Oh, right there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. We have to break into there. Once we break into there, it's pretty much end game right there. So we could do Canyon Wreckage, Mojave Drive-In, Sierra Madre, or Utah, and hmm, I'm torn. I really kind of want to do the Mojave Drive-In. I think we're gonna do that one. Now we can't bring our companions with us, so this is going to be tricky. I think we can bring our, our one weapon, though. We're going to make a save before we do go in there real quick. If it doesn't turn out that we can do it with the rules we've already set in, in stone, um, we'll probably try a different one then. Where is... I need my knife in my hands.
Dead Wastelander, huh? Oh, he had a lottery ticket too, I guess. Brothers watching over here. Why is it, uh, why am I getting all these notifications popping up on here? I thought I had those turned off. It's usually turned off. I don't know what the deal is. Get these mole rats. These are whoa! Big Mama came out of the, uh, the woods there, out of that bush. Oh, I need to heal up. I'm gonna die. Can't hit her. He'll come back. Why are you running away? Oh my goodness. They're all like semi injured, too. Why are you running away? I've never seen this happen before. Look, I can't even get close to her. I wonder if it's like trying to lead me somewhere, maybe. Maybe? This has to be like... Maybe I can get like closer to it? No? See, where are you taking me, huh? It's like you're not taking me anywhere. You're just like going until you can't go anymore. What is that noise I keep hearing? This isn't like, there's nothing here. I'm like utterly confused about what's happening right now. Ooh, red scorpion. Yikes, uh, we should probably get out of here. That's bad news bears. Also, I don't know where my followers are either. And it killed our, no you don't. It killed our friend, uh, We just need to get across to the... Oh, man. I think we might be safe, though, because they have to, like, stop moving to attack. Oh! Oh, he's going to get me. Wait, wait, wait. What? Oh, this is not... Not what I wanted to do. Let's hope it just like fucks off. Come on. Go away. Make sure there's like nothing else around me.
I don't think we're in combat anymore. I think we're okay. I think we just have to be cautious. I, I don't know what it is. Something's telling me that we got to be cautious. Can't use it while you're crouched, huh? I'm not. I'm not in combat. What do you mean? Maybe. Let's go back to, yeah. Maybe if we'd like fast travel back. Does this do anything? I'm not in combat. What am I missing here? What What's going on? Let's wait, let's wait a little bit here. See if we can just do something else. Because all you have to do to get started for this is talk to the satellite, right? Oh, we gotta wait for midnight. Okay. I guess that makes sense. The midnight Mojave drive-in. We play a movie at midnight. Right, level 15 or higher. What are we at right now? Do we qualify? We do. We're at the recommended level. I think. Uh, I think this is gonna. This is gonna work out. This is my favorite DLC, by the way. <clears throat> In the years before the Great War, Big Mountain had been the home to the brightest minds of the 21st century. Scientists of vision were drawn to the facility to tackle the greatest technological challenges of the era. They sought to create a new world, fueled by technology, for the benefit I, uh, of all I want to see something really quick. I hate to break your guys' immersion, but uh, I want to see what the sonic emitters, other side, space age alloys, DNA Ooh. hybridization, force field particle research. Autodoc advances in cranial, cardiac, Maybe. and trauma surgery. No, this one is uh, this one's a little bit different, I guess. The hopes this might be like an actual movie that like separated itself from the rest of the game. In the electronic forges of Big Mountain. Let's try using free cam instead. Uh, I think that was it. The nucleus of this research uh, was go. the dome. A huge stone facility that held the labs of every science known to man. It is it was a the narrator? Where no problem could not be solved. What's his name? I think his name where was like no question ben or something could like not that. be answered. The Great War brought a new energy to Big Mountain and its scientists. Although sheltered from the front lines, the scientists waged their right, own war, fighting off. their battles at the atomic level. That's uh, that's enough fun for today, huh? What do you think? Hey, what's up, Zach? How you doing? Hope you're having a great day today. Equations and calculations marched endlessly across chalkboards and computer Damn terminals it. toward one solution: winning the war. <clears throat> For years, the mines and computers of Big Mountain were a blaze of trajectories, weapon schematics, and this is my theories. this is my least favorite thing the about the problems began to Big outpace Mountain. the solutions. Is that First, you know it has a great story, then, but the dialogue it takes so long. As the war it's like um, so did the questions. Yeah, it's like Saving Private Ryan. You know, it's a really good movie. 
two thousand seven hundred and seventy-seven. Or what's, what's, uh, what's another really received an answer just... that put all their questions the Titanic? to rest. That's also pretty long. In the aftermath, you're good. That's good. Big Mountain Silent yeah, big brain DLC. You got that sleep. right. Their creator slowly dying in the new world that had been left behind. And the I'm, I'm kind of I'm setting myself up here because I kind of want to draw this out till Friday, and then over wonders. the weekend we'll do something different. Wonders that in the end, but I want to start fresh with a new challenge the next wrong week. Question. Because as much as I love this Walter thing, it's uh, it's starting to make me feel tired. Oh, about time. There we go. Uh oh. Uh, boy, it's been a minute since I've done this DLC. But if I if I remember anything correctly, I don't think. Oh, you know what? Yeah, we didn't keep anything from. Uh oh. No. Oh! Oh, we just started. No. Oh, no. Oh. God, that sucks. Uh, hold on. Let me get the let me get the thing open really quick. Let's get the task manager and then You keep your stuff? Oh, do you? I thought you didn't. I don't know. I was really worried that you you didn't do that. Alright, and we're also going to open up, I need to open up my thing really quick. There we go, that should be good there. Alright, let's try, let's try and get, uh, let's try and get this going again. Let's hope this works. I swear, if we gotta go through... All that again. I might I might just lose my shit live on stream. Continue. Oh, you got to be fucking shitting me. Oh. I'm super disappointed. All right. Let's hurry up and get this done. Let's get this done so that way we can hurry up and get over to the big mountain so that way we can do our save. And then the game can crash. Wait, it's not disconnected. Don't do that. <clears throat> In the years before the Great War, Big Mountain had been the home to the brightest minds of the 21st century. Isn't the uh, geographical location of Big Mountain unknown? To tackle the yeah, right. Technological challenges oh, I'm so the sorry. They sought to create a new world. I'm digging that guy on the far right, though. He's, he's got the, for the, the fucking manliest beard mankind. I've ever seen in my entire life. Sonic emitters, space age alloys, DNA hybridization, force field particle research, autodoc advances in cranial, cardiac, and trauma surgery. The hopes and dreams of a century became realities in the electronic forges <laughs> of <laughs> Big <laughs> Mountain. <laughs> the nucleus of this research was the dome. A huge stone facility that held the labs of every science known to man. It was a think tank where no problem could not be solved. 
where no question could not be answered. The Great War brought a new energy to Big Mountain there needs and to be its way scientists. To skip this. Although sheltered from the front lines, the scientists waged their own war, fighting their battles at the atomic level. Equations and calculations marched endlessly across chalkboards and computer terminals toward one solution, winning the war. For years, the mines and computers of Big Mountain were a blaze of trajectories, weapon schematics, and nuclear theories. The problems began to outpace the solutions. First, <sighs> yeah, it was thick, though. then God exponentially. Damn. As the war escalated, so did the questions. On the night of October 23rd, 2077, the scientists received an answer that put all their questions to rest. In the aftermath, Big Mountain's silent experiments went to sleep, their creators slowly dying in the new world that had been left behind. And the great stone in the middle of the Big Empty lay untouched, filled with countless technological wonders. Wonders that, in the end, had been answers to the wrong question. Big crater, yeah. It's a big ol' stink pit, ain't it? Alright, save. Just like that. What was in the, the tote bag here? Hey, a sarsaparilla machine. Don't mind if I do. Oh, there's all kinds of trash in here. Not really anything I need, though. What we, what we really should be keeping our eyes open for is uh, turpentine. This toaster talks to us, right? Yeah, everything in this room fucking talks to us. I didn't want to miss your spine. Walter. You're looking a little floppy, Walter. I didn't want to pick up those mentats. Everything is so nice and clean. Whoa! I forgot about this. Oh my god. Oh, it's all coming back to me. Just how great this uh, this DLC is. There's a safe in here for a reason? Like a mysterious reason? This room requires a key. Oh, for storage. Yeah, I mean, I guess that makes sense because this is like your uh, your player home for a minute. The Big Mountain's like actually really big. Like, honest to God, I, I feel like Big Mountain can be its own like little spin-off game if it really tried hard enough. Everything's like broken too. Uh. Soda pops in here. A little bit. You find you cannot draw your weapon for some reason. Oh. What? What you got up here, boys? I thought I heard Now time for uh, a 20 minute you. dialogue. Nobody Interaction. I'll handle this. Be warned, intruder! You bad, are in the presence of a mighty. I. Because we can actually kind of skip past this. See what I mean, though? I mean, that's a lot of. Um, a lot of talk in there. The bottom eye, yeah. Uh. 
If it isn't my old colleagues, the mighty think tank of Big Mountain, Big Fools, all of you. It is I, Dr. Mobius, transmitting from my dome-shaped dome in the Forbidden Zone, a zone that is, yes, forbidden to you! I like the, uh, the comedy that's going on here. Mobius. Very well. Written. Always the same broadcast. He's clear. What did they do, like, Walter? Walter. I'm not having sex with you right now, Walter. You just. Oh, I didn't read any of that. I probably should have. Uh. Come on. Oops. Spineless perk, yeah. We can read all that here in a minute. That auto dock junk heap. Oh my god. Uh. My thumb is actually getting tired. I don't know, uh. Can we, like, be done? I don't, I don't... This is like that time when you see your friend, but you don't really want to like talk to them or anything, but they come up to you, and you're trying to be all like, oh shit, you know, it's good seeing you, but I think we should go there like, no you know, hang out some other time. Oh, should I? I don't remember the, I think the last time I played this I did the dialogue tree, but god, that was like... A while ago. That was, uh, I think the last time I played this DLC was before I moved into my apartment. Back when I was living in an apartment. Uh. We put our points in melee. I want to put 10 points in melee, actually. We get a lot of ex or, uh, extra points to distribute. Uh. Lockpick might be a good one, actually. We're using a knife. A knife counts as a melee, doesn't it? Or can we use any melee weapon? No, I think we're just... We're stuck to the knife, and we can't really use anything else. With the exception of, like, storytelling. You know, we use the bomb for the fucking Walter White thing with the... Uh, uh, Gustav. Uh, might as well just put the rest of my points in lock picking. We got down here. Oh, I can pick another skill. Tag. Uh. trying to think I think there's a lot of robots over here so a good perk to pick would be do we have the the one where you can disable robots robotics experts yeah this is the one I was talking about I think this would be a, a smart choice for us uh fuck all right you know what let's go get uh Let's go get started, I guess. We got a long uh, walk ahead of us. In this metaphorical path we chose. 
salutations and felicitations, sir, and a most jocund welcome to the scene. Oh, I gotta talk to them first, yeah. Hold on. Let's go talk to them. Did you retrieve the technologies yet? We need them, as I have indicated. Uh... Science. I th I'm thinking Walt's gonna pick the science options 100% of the time. Uh, I'd be honored if you could uh, hear any knowledge, or sorry, I'd be honored if I could hear any knowledge the think tank had to share on the science. Why, yes. We are filled with the knowledge you speak of. If you wish to know more, simply ask the others. They can help you. Uh, you're the one in charge, though, aren't you? I am Dr. Klein, Chief Head Researcher of Logistical Operations and Ideology here at Big Mountain. I am surprised you have not heard of me. I am first in my field. First chair, as it were, back in the days of chairs. Back in the chase. Chairs. Yeah, chairs don't exist anymore in the future. He was the bearded guy? Ooh. Uh. Yeah, what's up with this passive sensation? It's a side effect of the cerebral scrubbing. It won't stop you from excreting. Or asking questions, apparently. I have to correct that next time. Hormonal aggressive tendencies are actively suppressed, however. They are a no-no and not permitted in the think tank. The scrubbing also ensures your silence to keep Big Mountain safe. This facility is top secret, and you cannot speak of it to anyone outside of Big Mountain. Should have done it with the last batch. And the anti-aggression scrub. Take your pants off. Take a shit on the floor. Fuck. What was that? Uh, that that Rick and Morty song that they did. Where they they had to save the planet from like annihilation or something, and the whole thing was hosted in a singing competition. What a fucking show. That show is something else. Get swifty, yeah. Get swifty. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, but I like to fight. We had to take precautions after the last visitors. They caused a great deal of damage in a short time. Should have made sure they couldn't mention Big Mountain once they left. An oversight. Yeah, you don't want to miss any of those oversights. Uh, who were these visitors? Dr. Eight and Dr. O could tell you more. Dr. O more than Eight. The battle against the visitors damaged Eight's voice module. Suffice to say, those visitors are unwelcome. They stole a great many secrets and much technology. Impertinent. They also broke one of my trains. Oh, that bastard. Who's Dr. Dr. Mobius? Mobius was not the horrifying creature you saw upon the screen, twisted by science. He was once one of us. A friend. He researched in directions contrary to the think tank. Brains, 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 always about the brains. So we exiled him. He says he left of his own volition, but that was to save him the embarrassment. Now he sends his intelligence-consuming scorpions from the Forbidden Zone to plunder the secrets of Big Mountain. <laughs> he yeah. is a menace. So much knowledge. Uh... These mechanical robo-scorpions consume intelligence. Are you certain of their findings? Dr. O is certain of his findings, and no one else in the think tank is willing to test the results. Loss of brainial power. Terrifying. O has said on many occasions his inability to comprehend Mobius' robo-schematics is because of repeated robo-scorpion uh, stings. You know what we should do? We should play through this DLC with a character of zero intelligence. Or not zero, but what, I think the lowest you can go is one. You know what I mean? Like, drop that shit as low as we can. I want to see, like, what kind of different outcomes you might get through it. Because I'm sure there's there's got to be something, you know what I mean? Uh... I'm going to go talk to the other ones. Let's go do some speech checks with them, I guess. If there's an 8, then maybe there's a 0. Yeah. 
What is eight but not two zeros sitting on top of each other wearing a trench coat trying to go see a movie made for adults? Oop, I'm like getting stuck on the corner there. Where are the other ones at? Have you done all we have? I can't get in trouble for opening ask, this, I guess. If not, we will not hesitate to ask again. Whoa, don't do that. Don't ask a second time there, pal. Better downstairs. Well, since I've opened every other door. Oh, I can't even do anything with that one. Easy experience. Whoops. I think it might be the other way, actually. Yeah, there it is. <clears throat> oh, here we are. The lobotomite animal before me. What other terrifying terrors will plague us in our quest for knowledge? Communists? Communist animals, perhaps? Oh, shit. Be warned. Attempt to propaganda me. I will shriek as a frightened babe calling loyal cyber dogs to my aid. Do you comprehend, commie animal? Uh. Animal. Did you just call me an animal? Yes, animal. Hormones, pores, glands, all wrapped up in skin. Who knows what terrifying secrets lie beneath your epidermis. Scalpels shall tell us your secrets, even if we must cut deep for such knowledge. I was head of my biology class at American High, you know. Uh, what do you do here? Before you is the brain of Dr. Boros, head of animology, bestology, and DNA scrambling technology here at Big Mountain. I lay the bones and hearts of animals bare beneath Isn't my that... searing gaze, Hold especially on a the dogs. I did so love dogs once. Did he, uh... Gabe, that he, he said, uh, bestiology. Isn't that the isn't that the thing where you animals to you, shape you did all your dogs? Casadors, the happy go lucky night stalkers. They are my living, breathing DNA test tubes. Uh Okay, Casadors? Indeed. Docile. No. Curious. Safe. Sterile. They are contained here I was at say, that make for a pretty fucked up story. DNA Bestiology. And for yeah, observation. That's the bad one. Bestiology must just be studying beasts then. Not ology. I don't know. I'm not a I'm not a teacher English guy. Words are hard. Uh no, such creatures are found only here, for research purposes. They would no more be capable of escape than breeding. Alright, we've spoken Until enough. Next let's see, uh... Let's go talk to this guy right here. This guy seems like fun. Doctor A. <laughs> Boy, he really is a blast. Uh... What? Uh, your voice module got damaged. Yeah. Uh, better not be cussing at me. Uh, fuck, I don't know what to say to this guy. I guess we'll see you later. You are an unusual specimen to so boldly walk into the mighty expanse of the think tank, fearless and proud as a teddy bear. Between the extraction of their higher reasoning abilities and urination-inducing fear, most of the bottom mites dare not approach us. Yeah. Uh... Yeah, let me go back to him and ask him a question. Let's see. Uh, 
Uh, I get all the technologies, right? Uh. Do you know anything about Marbius sort or of the Forbidden Zone? It's it's hard communicating with them. It's a real shame. Uh. Yeah, calm down. I didn't mean to alarm you. Who are you? You flirt with the female doctor, really? Hmm. Well, Fisto's out of the picture. I mean, I am sporting for a new uh, Robo Pal. Uh, double circle dash. Oh, here we go. Wait, after listening a bit, that's Robco, Termlink, Protocol, bo uh, you're broadcasting, right? Yeah. Ah, I'm just full of surprises. Uh... Nice pun on the header. I don't really know what else to say to him. Oh, we got more. We got more uh, checks here. Okay, if that's Rob Code Termlink Protocol, doesn't that mean it can be hacked? Okay, I think we're getting closer somewhere here. Uh, it'll only take one second to violate your rights and make your voice mine. Or should I be helpful say something helpful? I think I'll say something helpful. If that's certainly code, don't worry. I'm going to take advantage of your exposed code. Oh, no, no, wait. They're both, uh, they're both like that, I guess. Let me just choose the first one. Oh, it said not. I don't know, my, my brain is skipping beats today. I I got some awful sleep last night, let me tell ya. Restart. What I did, I screw up. Wait, what am I supposed to be doing? What's the what's the end goal here? He wrote program dude. Oh, I want to befriend them all? Wait, what is doing, what does befriending them all do? So I'm, I'm like, I'm trying to remember exactly what, what, uh, entails with this DLC. I'm not drawn back exactly, I just remember having a good time with it, and, uh, the big scorpions, that's all I get. Saves you from getting fried later? Nah, it can't be that bad, right? Because what, is it just like... Combat? Fight them only with a knife? Uh, yeah, you know what, you're probably right. Foresight's 2020, I guess. Uh... 
Hold on. Should I... Do I need to reset? Here, I gotta reset entirely, don't I? I redo my load. My big fat load here. There we go. Yeah. Oh, uh, thank God for door saves. Alright, let's be more careful this time. Let's try to get, like, good dialogue options, I guess. Uh, can you speak? Do you understand me? Uh, did something happen to your voice module? Uh... Is that a yes? Can I ask you some questions? Who are you? This feels like, uh, you remember those old ghost hunting shows? Where they had, uh, you know, that one guy, you got that one, like, edgelord guy. Make active. Uh, no, but the the one guy who was like all edge lord and shit like that, and he would talk into the air, and he would hold up the static machine and be like, "Ghost, are you st are, were you killed? Were you killed in a terrible way?" And then the static thing would go, <sighs> and he'd be like, "Oh my God, did you hear that? They're speaking to us." Every time. Uh Stop <laughs> hunting the ghost, Walter. Walter, I need my phone back, Walter. You quit playing with those ghost apps on there, Walter. Uh alright, alright, just calm down. Didn't mean to alarm you. You tell me about these technologies, Klein ones. Uh, you sound agitated. Tell me about the big empty. No, no need to get into indignant. Well, that's a big word. Uh, I was just asking a question. Is there anything else? Oh, no. Okay, so, after listening for a bit, that's a Rob Code turn Uh, well, I've hacked enough Rob Code terminals to know. Well, the code's got some problems, I'm not arguing that. I agree, if someone would take the time, you're more than the sound effects than a tank, yeah. If that's Robco Termlink, doesn't that mean it can be hacked? I'm not going to take advantage of your exposed code. There we go. There we go, look at that, we got some karma too. Oh, disgusting. Uh, not a problem, I know what it's like to be experimented on. Alright, we'll be going now. Yeah, I think we, I think we got it. Go lobotomize animal before me. What other terrifying terrors will plague us in our quest for knowledge? Communists? Communist animals, perhaps? Be warned. Attempt to propaganda me. I will shriek as a frightened babe calling loyal cyber dogs to my aid. Do you comprehend, commie animal? Uh, calm down, I just had some questions. Just as I feared. 
questions, quizzes, just as there were in American high school. And if there are no answers, how will the think tank graduate? God, these guys give me a headache. <laughs> uh, what are you? What do you do? Before you is the brain of Dr. Boros, head of animology, bestology, and DNA scrambling technology here at Big Mountain. I lay the Boris bones and ahead. hearts he of animals bare beneath ahead. my searing gaze, especially the dogs. I did so love dogs once. Especially Gabe, that rascal. But there are many animals to shape. Industrious Cazadors, the happy-go-lucky Night Stalkers. They are my living, breathing DNA test tubes. Uh... Indeed. This guy's like Fossil, putting a shock on my curious, system here. Safe. Sterile. They Boris, Boris needs to like fucking chill out and go take a nap. DNA and for observation. Oh man. Uh, I don't think they're sterile. They breed, all right. I cannot expect a lobotomite to understand the careful surgical castrating procedures used in their creation. Perhaps a demonstration of my That's castrating a good idea. power would settle your doubts. Uh, no, that's all right. Trust me. Oh, that's too bad. Perhaps we can perform a sterility castration some other time then. All right, we've spoken enough. I uh, I gotta step away from him. Holy Christ! Life finds a way. Yeah, sure does. Uh, let's go try to let's go try to get a uh, little miss. Uh, no, it's not I don't her. understand how you get. You are an unusual specimen. To her, so boldly uh, walk robotic into the mighty expanse of the think tank, fearless and proud as a teddy bear. Between the extraction of their higher reasoning abilities and urination-inducing fear, most lobotomites dare not approach us, let alone speak to us. Yet you have no such fear. Facing me, epidermis fleshed with blood, plasma running molten beneath, your face contorting with muscular expression. She's giving me, like, fucking Hellraiser vibes. Say a few words. Face towards the monitors, please. So that I might record it for further examination. Like, she was a, she was a Cenobite in her former life. Uh, the quick scribe jumped over to Lazy Paladin. Yes, yes, go on. Seeing your lips and mouth forming words, both revolting and somehow... How does it feel to have the flesh roll around in your mouth so like dirty. that? To control Feeling each a little muscle and the tongue? Like having a fish or extremely dexterous slug lolling and flopping in one's mouth cavity. Um... So it seems to me you have more uh, biological needs than your counterparts. <clears throat> what? Nonsense. Uh. Close eyelids. Breathe deeply, then stretch languidly. What? What are you doing? Oh boy. Uh, run your hands along the sides of your face and then exhale rapidly. Stop it. Why? Why are you making me partake in this filthy formography? Oh my god, it just keeps on going. Uh, turn head and cough roughly, then slowly scratch nose. Enough. I'm already intrigued. You have sufficiently percolated me. I don't know what it is about the biology of lobotomites. It 
It infects my thoughts. All that skin and muscle and tissue. Uh, listen, why don't you just give in? There's nothing wrong with uh, a little human on robo action, you know? And so penises. Perhaps there is value in what you Look say. at them wiggle. I, I did so enjoy breathing once, long ago. Um, I could come back any time and just breathe, if you'd like. Would you? I feel so ashamed, but yet so intrigued. You'll need to give me a rest in between visits, or else my gel might run over. If you're ready, let me radar scan you. Slowly. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. Purple, purple. Ooh. What? Bloop, bloop. Wait, I hope Twitch doesn't fucking ban here. I've had a rest. I felt a little, a little, felt a little more erotic right than now. it really should have been. <laughs> Makes me very uncomfortable too. <laughs> uh, okay, well, we, I think we've spoken Into enough. Next we need to. Uh, my intriguing little lobotomite. Yeah, sure. And those leg things. Breaking news! Talking Lobotomite arrives in Think Tank. Its purpose? Unknown. Undefinable. Its presence here? Unpossible. Uh, you're Dr. Zero, right? Oh? Oh, yes. I'm not going to bother correcting you. At least you got the doctor part correct. I can be grateful for that, at least. Stop the presses! Just in for my eye monitors. Is that Rob Kotek on your arm? It is! What's your agenda bringing that in here? Uh, it's my, it's my pit boy. How dare you bring Rob Kotek in here? What are you showing off? How great Robert House and his big company are? Ooh, we can make Securitrons better than any robot those geniuses at Big Mountain can make, and they'll last a thousand years. Uh, you're lucky I don't have hands to tear that dip boy off your arm, or feet to stomp on its stupid metal guts. Ugh. Damn Robco. Uh, well, you don't need to worry about Mr. House anymore. Yeah. <laughs> worry about House? Why he, he's do done that? so. Done's Rooney. Hope he died alone in a dingy room, streaming his last remaining bodily fluids into jars. And him and his dirty girl bots. Don't even get me started on those filthy biological catcher's mitts. Uh, listen, yeah, I, we calm down. We just need uh, some Fine. questions. Ask. Uh, what do you do here? All things robotical. You see a robot? I made it. See a broken robot? I made it that way. Deconstructed it down to parts. I have a gift with machines. I can render anything inoperable. Preserve them in a non-functioning state. Uh, that doesn't really sound impressive. Well, yeah, that doesn't really sound impressive. Who asked you? You just wait until a working machine threatens you, and you'll wish I was around. Uh... I need more of those worthless caps. I'd have a few left. Let me check. Yeah, there were a few under the monitors here. Here you go. Keeps the place tidy. Oh, 50 bottle caps just for, uh... Does he have another name? Yeah, let's ask him that. Yeah, I do. It wasn't always O. I just took that one by default because sometimes it's easier to accept the mistake as long as the purpose works. I don't want to get into it. It's a sore topic with me. It makes my gel ripple. Uh, are you sure? I'm a good listener. Uh, got ears for it. Great! Psychology! Clearly the worst of the sciences, right after colostodiuretics. Okay, so my name is an O. Never was. It was circular, a single character, digit, but not O. 
But even with enhanced sensors, no one here could get it right. Always kept seeing the letter, not the number. Uh, so if they keep confusing the letter with the number, your name is Dr. Zero. Dr. Zero. Yes, thank you. Zero. I am zero. How hard is that? A narrow, thin zero. It's a black hole number, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I, d I don't know. Zero sounds more impressive. Zero's my name. I'm proud of it, alright? It doesn't get the recognition it deserves. Truth be told, my emotional attachment to it doesn't even register compared to just having people recognize the difference. It's just that they're both sort of round and hollow, so when they monitor scan them, they assume that, oh, it's O. Oh. Vivisect me, please. Uh, if you wanted to differentiate the O and the zero, just put a slash through zero. What? Uh, zero, draw a slash through it. Did... Did I shoot myself with a brainial beam or something? That's brilliant! I mean, I would have come to the same conclusion... <laughs> eventually. Oh, uh, who am I deceiving? I never would have figured that out. I can't figure anything out. I'm... Uh, I'm useless. Uh... Oh, uh, boy. Um... And that what make that's what makes you a true true zero. Exactly. At least the old name was indisputable. O is more like surprise. Oh, look what I stepped in. Uh. There's power in zero. Yeah. Well, of course it yeah, does. This is what, uh, that's what the most lethal of mathematics. That's pretty cool, actually. Destroyer of numbers. I already wreck every robot I study. Why not basic arithmetic? I like your solution. With that kind of slash in the middle, I can set myself apart. If I wanted to. To make a zero in all the think tank, they won't be able to escape it. That diagonal slash right down the middle. Thanks. Talking to you, it really helped unclog some frustration. Talking. What a primitive form of thought kicking. Cyber villain, like I've seen. God damn it! It's like that. It's like that one episode uh, where where Walt Jr. was trying to make cereal, and then he spilled his cereal all over the table like some kind of goddamn degenerate. And Walt had to clean it up. Uh, any amazing discoveries? You know, hearing my name said like that, it really derezzes my screens. As for discoveries, well, of oh, course. Right. Look at this. Just uh, built it. Amazing, isn't it? Uh, yeah. You know sure what? Was. I'm not even gonna pretend. I broke one of the monitors, and those innards well, start falling place. out everywhere. If you could just hold on to that for me until definitely well, forever, that would be welcome. Is that stuck on? Oh, nothing. Uh Okay. I've had Until enough. That's the uh, that's the next big uh YouTube venture there. Walt Jr. plays. He's gonna be like the next PewDiePie. Spider Cash. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? No! Fuck! I didn't save. Oh my god. How much is uh what is the going rate on on V bucks nowadays? Got to do everything again. I'm so fucking Well, it was mostly just choices on the top. Maybe we could just fucking blast through it, you know? Like Jimmy Neutron. Oh man. We gotta do both their dialogues again. I don't think I saved after talking to Dawn. You are an unusual. Uh. 
just gonna blast through this. I don't wanna. I don't wanna have to listen to it uh, anymore. Breaking news. We really set ourselves up for success in this too. I think uh I, Thanks just playing with Wall. Talking to you. I think I got lucky there, you know what I mean? Uh I don't know if this is necessary. Until our next Yeah, save, absolutely. Well it's fresh in my head. Alright, there we go, we're done. Let's go get fucked up in the, the big MT. Where's our first, uh... I need a map really quick. Let's see. XA... X2 and X13. Let's get hung over in the MT. Uh, fuck. I'm trying to remember. I think this one here is surrounded by robot dogs, but might actually be the easiest one to do. If I if I remember correctly. Intruder. You Whoa, must fuck. hate the eyes of my robo-scorpions, or their pincers. I don't remember, uh, most of the enemies in- Oh, Christ! Yeah, most of the enemies in the Big MT have, uh... Christ. Have, uh... What, melee weapons, not so much any firearms, I think, right? I don't remember there being any... Oh my god. Oh, you know what? We didn't, uh, fuck. I should have, um. I should have repaired my knife before we left. I've gone all this time, I haven't done anything with it. Flash the locking eyes. Uh. I don't. I can't, I can't use the stim pack. Thankfully, there's like soda all over the place. Oh man! Like truth be told, I'm like a little daunted by all this DLC. And now that we've got it started, I'm like fucking regretting it. But now I gotta see it through, cause I, I ain't no bitch. Oh. Shouldn't be too bad though. One companion in this DLC? Isn't it, uh... It's, uh, the robo-dog, isn't it? It's one of the robo-dogs, I think. Please, don't take this personally. Oh. I'm not programmed to fail. Just so you know. Oh, I don't want that. I just want to get up here. She can't leave her facility. I don't need that. Man, I really, I don't remember too much about this. Whoa! I thought that was our friend there for a second. It's not. These are not our friends. You know what? That might be the strat, though. It's just, uh... Can Walt wear combat armor? Can he? Uh, hold on. Let me see really quick. Let's see. 
If I have it written they down that we can't. I don't have any rule here that says I can't. I think we've just been playing this whole game. Look. Yeah, hold on a second. Yeah, let me go get the combat armor. Fucking stop with the noise. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, wait. Hold on a second. Let's read our statuses really quick. So, spineless strength gives us one strength. That's nice. I thought there were other ones that we got too. I guess not. Alright. Uh, I should probably put some water in me or something. The other perks? Oh, I guess that makes sense. Hold on. Let's, uh, let's check them out really quick. We got Brainless, advanced technologies, your head can no longer be crippled. Okay, that's nice. Uh, and resistant to chem addiction. 25% resistance. Plus 25% resistance. Look at that. Uh, and shock from bodily damage. Plus 5 damage threshold. Minimum plus 1. Okay. What else did we get? Spineless, which is... Oh, okay. Your spine has been replaced with advanced technologies. Your torso can no longer be crippled in your strength and damage threshold uh, have increased plus one. Oh, heartless, yeah. I was looking for that one. Uh, your heart has been replaced with advanced technologies. You cannot be poisoned and filters in your heart will also regulate bleeding and he uh, healing, allowing all items to function at a higher level. Robots are now confused by you and 50% less likely to score a critical hit. Okay. I can dig it. Excuse me, robot. We need to skip, or I need to keep this. Oh man, we are just like brutalizing our weapons here. This seems like a bad idea. I think, I think the strap might be just not doing anything. No poison. You're right, that would be a good one. Because you get to keep only one of them, right? Something like that, when you leave. Uh, there's nothing there. No? Wow, that's a shame. I hope this unpleasantness will be over soon. Oh, it's your brain. Oh, I died. I leveled up. I didn't level up last time. Where am I supposed to be going, actually? You have insulted my honor, and for that, you must die. I need uh, I need to put some help in me. Um. to keep our eyes open for it, see if we can find it. Because um, we're going to come back to this. This isn't going to be this one stream, of course. I want to really kind of get the most out of this as I can. Active terminal, there we go. Pop up everywhere. Ah. Um... No, I mean, we're going to be playing this till, till Friday, probably, should be told. I know, I'm, I'm kind of slow with DLC, and it's like, piss, oh man, um, I'm kind of slow with the DLCs and Fallout, so, and then, uh, come Friday, we'll finish the game, and everything will be on the way, we'll win, we'll kill Caesar, we'll turn him into spaghetti,
I don't want to eat the Brock flowers. We might have to, though. I should have, uh, I should have started cooking. like do something 23 stab wounds hey hey it wasn't stab wounds they were the mountain berries remember that's what we're gonna tell everyone was it up here that we needed to go to I don't actually know what we're supposed to be doing here the, the robots are kind of stressing me out truth be told Who gets to clean up all this blood? Me, that's who. They're not doing the best job of hitting me. Knock on wood, of course. I mean... Oh, yes. It's like a it's bunch of stormtroopers trying to, trying to get me here. Hmm. For Queen and Country! Axes to make it easier. Uh, we could. I mean, honestly, what I'm thinking right now is we take this as a as a pacifist run. That's the strat that I'm kind of thinking right now. I'm gonna put points. I'm gonna I'm gonna slam points on melee. Because it might help. We need to find a way to fix our uh, knife, though. I Oh, you know what? I might have a weapon repair kit. Uh, which, if that's the case... Christ almighty, I can't get comfy. Uh, if that's the case, uh, we might be okay. Uh, one more point. Let's throw it on repair. I'm sorry, sir, but you forced me to utilize deadly force. I... Um There we go. I'm not programmed to fail. Just I think we we just eat it, don't we? We eat it and then our knife gets like more fixed. Yeah, a little bit. Let's try to get that up a little higher. One more. Yeah. There it is. We've used them all up. Yeah, it looks like the, the robots and the dogs are in a, a fight with each other. What the fuck just happened? Could find or buy more. Well, you could, uh, what? Ooh. Watch out. Uh, wait, if I keep, if I go back to the big sink, or whatever it was called, we can buy weapons from our player house, right? But we have to get it activated. I think. Something like that. Please avoid boom down for the foreseeable future until weapon testing is resolved. What's this, uh, I, I want to get the, the tiny... Uh, yes, man. Whatever that thing is called, I want to get that thing started up again. That that looks. I can't remember exactly what it does, and it, it just looks adorable. Muggy, yeah. Let's turn Muggy on. God, the lobotomites have seen me. This side. Uh, oh, that's a night stalker. Oh my God! Oh, I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! Ooh, hold on. Go back up to. We had water, didn't we? Uh, maybe we already ate it. I 
Thankfully, this uh, this big old creepo. Oh no, he's moving faster than I thought he did. I thought he moved at the same uh, same speed I did, but he does not. He's only slightly faster. If I talk to the sink, who the uh, the 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 big the big thing tinkers? And you go to the sink. Might I be of service, sir? The big round table. Uh, what services do you provide? In addition to managing the personality matrices <laughs> of the other household utilities, I can provide, sir, with direct access to the commissary. Any goods, sir, might require may be purchased through my shopkeep interface, whence tiny robots shall deliver them forthwith to this very domicile. I'm in love with it. Uh, I'd like to buy some things, please. Very good, sir. And might I venture to opine that a new trilby might be just the thing to complete sir's ensemble. Hey, that's the that's the Walter White hat, isn't it? The Trilby? Something like that. That's the that's the mission. That's uh this is the canon lore onto where Walter White got his, his goofy hat. Ooh, yikes, look at the price on that. Uh, might as well get the combat helmet. For sake of protection, we need water. Or just really things that we can use to, to fix ourselves. Oh, I have the sonic emitter? So then, why can I buy? Can I buy a second one? Oh, no, maybe that's, uh... Like, the upgraded version? How do you say it? I always thought it was mutt fruit, but I guess I've been saying it wrong my entire life, and it's actually called mute fruit. Moot fruit, or something like that. Uh, oh yeah, I do. Oh my god, I have, yeah, I have the exact same one. No, I don't. Yeah, I do. He does need to use the gun. It kind of breaks the challenge. Uh, but... Hold on a second. It is, um... It is... I, I should probably hotkey this. Um, I, I did write it in the rules, though, that we can use... Hold on a second, let me see. Where is it at? The, yeah, we can use... Uh, we can use different weapons and items, but only if it's required through a quest. So, like... If we really play semantics on this, we I think it counts. I think we can handle it. It doesn't break the challenge. <sighs> well, how about that? Old auto docks back online. Well, all right. Come here. Let's have a look at you. Well... He ain't the fittest horse that ever ran a race, but he don't appear in immediate danger of keeling over. I can patch you up if you want. Uh, ask the sink about the personalities. All right, yeah. Mr. Sink? Might I be of service, sir? Uh, yes, no. Switch off the sink's personality matrices. Very good indeed, sir. Throwing out the riffraff protocols engaged. All personality matrices are offline, sir. I need... Oh, I could have just gotten my equipment repaired here. Uh... Are you some kind of artificial intelligence? Regrettably not, sir. No. All modules in this habitat are synthetic personalities atop a mundane operating system. There is no intelligence here, sir. Indeed, sir. Though if sir's aim is to activate them, I lament to inform, sir, that most have been offline for some years. If sir were to ask my opinion, I should venture that sir is better off without them. However, 
If so, is determined to inflict upon Sir's self, then... Oh, I see now. So it kind of gives the toaster a personality. Ah, okay. That makes sense. Tragically, the core operating systems are also located on the personality tapes, sir. Once the tape is installed, sir, I just I picked one up from that one building, I think, didn't we? And I shall oblige with great delectation. However, sir will still be required to locate and install a backup hollow tape to access their functionality. Uh, uh, let me ask you something else here. Sir. Switch the mind. Do you, sir? Well, if that is sir's wish, it is. Yeah. Okay. Very good. <laughs> He's snoring. We've got, uh, I think we've got the number eight. Which. Oh, what kinds of food? Oh, there's water in here. I'm sure we need that for, like, some kind of mission later, but watch me. Um, watch me waste it. But besides, we really need all the health we can get. Outdated auto dock. We you require some additional job. services. And rightly so, I should think. All right then. What? I can get... Hold on, what does this do here? Swap body parts. Oh, okay. So, I guess there's something else I gotta do. What about a physical exam? Yeah, he's got me there. You require some additional services? That's for the brain. Oh, it's, oh yeah, so that way we can get it back in and out. Yeah. Uh, okay. The book shoot. Uh, what else is there in here? There's a workbench. Nothing we can really do here. Perhaps sir would care to put sir's feet up. And I might serenade, sir, with the dulcet tones of a light opera. Oh, hey, hold on. This room's open now. There is your spine. Without a brain stem to snap it on. Oh, man. What's in here? Brain would be... Oh, it's... But it's missing. And then there's my little heart. My sweet, sweet heart. And it belongs to the big MT. Weird spine. It's uh it's it's a bit curved. It's a bit uh it's a bit wangly. It looks more like a question mark, didn't it? Hold on, let's take a second look at it really quick. Uh yeah, it's got a it's got an interesting curve to it. I don't know if that's how spines are supposed to look. Yikes. It did, it did look a little, um, a little under the weather, didn't it? How do I get out of here? This way. Alright. The Casador Preserve and the Night Stalker Splicing Facilities are strangely quiet. Too quiet. down here what is that trauma oh this is the fucked up uh check the personality files quest oh yeah you know what i should i should probably oh yeah it's already huh i guess it's already active Alright. No, these, uh, these suits are fucked up. I remember the lore for them kind of goes like, ah, shit. Um, what it kind of goes like, uh, 
the suits can keep your body alive even after the the person wearing them is dead. This is bad news, Bears, though. Um, pacifist might not be the choice over here, but also I don't think I can get close enough to fight them. I think we might just try to... We should try to avoid them at all costs. But, uh, no, the, the suit would bring back, like, the... Yeah, this, uh, the suits would bring the bodies back. Like, most of those people are dead. And they would, like, remember your tendencies and how you would walk around. There was a video. Again, I think it's the TK's Mantis. I watch a lot of his shit. Um, it's good stuff. I think he did, uh, he did, he was talking about them. Signal Hills transmitter, but it's not where we need to be. This seems like a good place to save really quick, though. <clears throat> well, oh, 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 I think we're all right. In the station and on top of it. All right, I have to the station. Is that one over there? The one we were just at? Oh, like up on top of it. I see. Okay. What are these, by the way? Oh, my confusion cells, but they're all drained. Let's see if we can get up there. I feel like there's a way up there from over here, maybe. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Oh, who's shooting me? Is it who gave the Lepotomites a gun? Ooh, Elijah's advanced. Uh... Oh my god, this is no good. Ah, I gotta get down. Oh my god, this is like 100% of my focus is right here. Oh. Quit moving. Oh, fuck. Yeah, let's uh let's give the let's give the <laughs> not this many. Let's give the sonic thing a try really quick. That does something against them, right? The sonic noise emitter, the dog whistle. I think it might have been because I went over there. There's like a patch of them or something. I might have like just drawn them in. Doing it. it turns them into oh my god. It's not doing anything on the Are we allowed to use this for combat? I don't think so. It's not even working. This is honest to god like a really bad weapon to use. Feels like a Walter gun. Feels like a water gun. With Walter's name on it. Oh, a duffel bag. Full of nothing we can use. Nothing we can use there either. Uh, 
drink some fresh water. Where did the other one go? He was just here a second ago. God, this whole DLC is just so chaotic, isn't it? Let's, uh, let's see. I wanted to try getting over on the mountain from that side, but... Oh my god. Yeah, they come in from like all directions. And it's inconsistent! This was something else. I am... Klein. Fuck. Oh my god. Alright. It's, it's not even worth it to get up there. I just... Let's blow it through here. Oh, I forgot about that. We'll, we'll, we'll get up there when we come back. If I could uh, jump, yeah. All right, botanical gardens. Oh, spitter plants. Whoa! I thought the pipe just kind of fell down. I guess not. Spore carriers. Seed package. Uh, thankfully, the seed carriers are fucking dumb as shit. Go into the station and grab the supplies. Yeah. How do I? Where is the entrance, though? That's what I need to know. It has to be down here. Ooh, okay, that was bad. Uh, oh wait, hold on. We didn't say fuck either. How's my weapon condition already trashed? down here maybe something's making some what yeah I'm dead thankfully these things kind of move slow they're not like the smartest they hit pretty hard but they're not the smartest when it comes to attacking so it kind of gives me a hot second to take in the situation and figure out what I need to do this time we're gonna save when we get a little bit closer ouch The station right there, right where? I'm losing my shit here. Up here? That's a transmitter. Ooh, hairstyling. There we go. Desk, maybe. <clears throat> no, the fucking hitboxes for these things are kind of goofy. Tapes are hidden everywhere, really. Hold on a second, let's see how sneaky they can be. There are tons of caps over here, though. Sunset Spirilla. We need that. Yeah, I'm gonna do a second sweep and see if I, I missed anything underneath. Oh, like right there. Barter skill. Oh, baby. 
We're never gonna use that. Is there nothing up there? No. Nothing in there moves around. Uh, anything over here? No. I don't see anything else. I think it was just those two. Let's look up on top of the lights. Oop. Nothing up on top of there either. Yeah, I think that's... Whoop, I don't want to say. I think that's all of them. Yeah, I kind of figured that's what you meant. I wanted to, I wanted to try to get as much out of the, uh, the room as I could. I'm in danger. <laughs> oh my god there needs to be we gotta figure out a strat you know that's what I'm gonna do cause this this was just a practice stream obviously um, the the real stream is gonna come tomorrow when I'm fucking kicking ass cause I watched the uh, the mitten squad exclusive strategy guide on how to beat big MT pacifist mode which I don't think he's ever done. Truth be told, I don't think anyone's ever done Big MT and Pacifist. I don't think I've ever seen it. And I watch these challenge runs like crazy. This is not where we need to go. That's the wrong place. And that's not my friend. Well, okay, I guess we're gonna get high too. You pansy ass pinko, getting tired? Thank God this uh, this robot's got fucking ass aim. Ready to die for your country? I'm I'm not gonna overwrite the save. I'm just making a new save because I'm a piece of shit. <clears throat> Nothing I can no, grab. Oh, yeah, see, that's what I mean. He zapped me in the next week. I wonder if we got the, uh, if we had the, uh, metal armor, if we took that perk that, that makes energy bounce off of it. Does that, I wonder if that applies for plasma. I know it works with lasers. But plasma energy is kind of a little different in it. Something like that. The controller's plugged in. I don't know what more you want from me. You're gonna learn how Uncle Sam deals with the color like metal. You smell of plasma in the morning. Oh, yikes. Did you just look for one? I don't think it's possible. Honestly, God, I don't think it's possible. Like, seriously, you know what? I'm, I'm actually... Hold on a second. This is something I'm so interested in. We're gonna make one. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do some more research. This isn't gonna be something that happens next week, I hope. But, uh... Old world blues. Uh, pass.
pacifist. I would be very interested in fucking trying to do one of those. There. Right up on the list. Right up there next to all the special ideas. I think a better question is how the fuck am I not dead yet though? I don't even think I'm going the right way. Mighty Fink Tank! Still cowering in your dome? Cower, you fools! Cower! This isn't where I need to be. I need to get over there somewhere. I don't know where I'm supposed to be, though. Yeah, right? Holy fuck. There it is. That's it right there. That's the money maker. No, it's not. It's not the money maker. This is the wrong place to be again. <sighs> New save. Let's fucking go. This is it. That's it right there. God, I've never I've never been so happy to see a fucking door. I wandered into the Forbidden Zone. I didn't just wander into it. I wandered my happy ass in there like I was on top of the world. I don't trust the door save. I don't think it did. Walking eye. Fuck. This is still alive, too. Wait, hold on. Is that going to come alive on us? I don't remember if that's a friend or foe. There are no enemies here? Oh, thank God. I was getting real anxious there for a second. Another walking eye. Sink. We got our friend. Oh fuck, that is a Venture Pro Zot. I didn't even fucking realize that, look at me. God, I, I gotta watch that show now. It's been so long since I watched it. I think, did, uh, I, think I saw it's on uh, HBO Max. I think that's the last place I saw it. No, I've been working on, uh, I've been working on catching up on Courage the Cowardly Dog lately. I've been watching that with my, uh, my little brother. He, he flips for that shit. I just want to see if there's... Ooh, there's a whole thing over here. Thank God we have the rebreather. Let's, uh... Don't forget to watch the walking eye. Fuck. I, yeah, I really need to get back into it. Ah, oh, okay, here we go. We're going to grab these. We're going to grab these because we might be able to use them. Um... I'm gonna try that perk out. We're gonna take it. We're gonna pray, do a little, do a little song and dance, uh, and we're just gonna boogie woogie. There's something floating underneath that, and I really want to see what it is. What's what called? TCL. Oh, oh yeah, you're right. We we have the power of God on our sides. We have we have God powers, and I forgot all about that. No, the the robotics perk, um, the robotics or not the robotics shoot, uh, knight in shining armor or whatever it is. Fuck! If I had the thing, if I had a sheet here, I could tell you exactly. But it's the one that makes energy weapons bounce, their their damage bounce off of you. Oh, uh, they're just they're not even full. They're drained. Oh my god. You think that one's broken? Oh, like it doesn't work? Uh, I mean, we can give it a shot. 
Because we're going to get to the next, uh... Oh, it's coded wrong. Oh, what a fucking trash perk, then. But well, there's got to be something that we can do. I'll have to... I'll have to thunk about this real hard. Between now and the next time we level up. Proton throwing axe. It's not one that we can use, but it's pretty interesting. There's a toaster down here. Oops, Sunset Sarsaparilla, too. We're gonna bring it home. We're gonna we're gonna give our our toaster at home a little friend. Oh, uh, there we go. Caution, but I don't think so. Perk does not provide any damage threshold uh, boost because the parameter that is referenced when checking the skill of any or of enemy weapon is energy instead of energy weapons. This means that the function is weapon oh, is weapon skill type will never return the value that can activate the perk effect because there is no weapon skill called energy. Oh, okay, I see. Well, I want to I wanna move on to the bot botanical gardens. That's what we want to do. I wonder if there... There has to be a fix for it, I bet ya. The Cazador Preserve and the Night Stalker Splicing Facilities are strangely quiet. Too quiet. They're weird. Get out of here. Oh, I didn't save. No, yeah, I did. I, I kind of saved. Patient zero. Oh, wait. <clears throat> I mean, really, that sounds like it could be an easy fix, too. And they just recently updated uh, Fallout New Vegas, didn't they? Or it was like some kind of patch or something like that. Oops, I don't want to load. I don't want to fuck up that hard. Or maybe it was Fallout 3. I don't fucking remember. They need to... Whoops, I, I didn't even fucking save in the right place. They they need to update... Um, what, Fallout 3 and fix the whole launching thing. Because that's, that's absolutely frustrating. I, I've always been trying to launch it out of Steam. And then, uh, what... Now, one day I'm told that, oh, you don't do that, you, you load it from the Xbox bar, or the Xbox loader, or whatever it's called. Because they can do something like that, though, can't they? You would think. What What is my goal up here, really quick? Okay. It's it's finding the thing still. So. Uh, whoops! It's right here. Oh, just let me get it. Oh my god! Slam that big book of science really quick. I don't think it's entirely actually no what we might have just wasted it. We could have sold it and made made more out of that. No, you do not stop that. Oh my god. There's another one up here. No! Stop! I gotta have something. I gotta have something here. I've got the white horse nettle, but it's 
endurance minus one, which is kind of a pinch off my health there anyways. Fuck it. I don't really have much of a choice. I gotta take the risk. Brock flowers, I gotta fucking eat them. I didn't want to do that. Oh, I think that was just... No, it wasn't. How are we gonna do this? Like, the only thing I can think of is sneaking up there, but then that goddamn monstrosity down there thinks, hey, we can, uh, we can blast you. Hold on a second, let me see if I can grab it this time. Just grab it, grab it! Oh, there's something in my eye right now, too, which makes everything worse. Much armor on my carriers. Never usually is just right here in an alien blaster. Wow. Yeah, but the, the alien blaster is like an OP gun, though. It? It's a one shot killer. There is something in my eyes that is killing me. Oh my god. I think it's frustration. That's what it is pure, unadulterated frustration from this. Ah, fucking robot. You know what? It sucks too, because he comes over here. Uh. Is there another My way of here? aggression is increasing geometrically. Do you hear me, think tank? Maybe if I go up. Oh, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Oh, you fucking dick. Alright, that's fine, whatever. Depends on what it is. No, you know what? That's what I remember back when the game came out. I, I think I was still in middle school. Uh, the the whatever the blaster. You know what I'm talking about. The uh, the one that you get from that kid in Freeside. Uh, everyone in my middle school was like, "Oh yeah, that was uh that was the best gun in the game. You could do like super super damage with it." But like also at the same time, none of us really realized that you had to get it connected with the uh, Helios one. So, for the longest time, we thought we were all spreading lies. Is that what it's called? The... Fuck, I, I don't even know. The Euclides? Am I far enough away from enemies to fast travel yet? Let's see. Oh my god. Actually, I gotta go down this way anyways, so... Uh... Broke your game. It It's a super buggy gun, though. But, oh, yeah, we, we thought we were all just spreading lies, like, haha, it's the best game, you gotta, like, yeah, look at this idiot, he's gonna spend his in-game currency, his caps on it. Does it? I wish I knew more about how these games worked. Oh, right, wait, you used it with a different ammo glitch, I see. Uh, something about rad score, not the rad scorpions, uh, um, robo scorpions are over here or something like that, I think, right? Would I just, like, go in there? I guess so. Hmm. <laughs> Infinite noose better. That's the way she goes, though. Uh. That, that, no. Oh, I can hear, like, little pitter patters, and it's, like, kind of freaking me out. TBH, it's giving me the EBGBs. I don't know how we're gonna get past this. In the toolbox? I should look in the toolbox, you think? Where? Oh! Look at that. I my my perception is actually really bad. IRL, hence the glasses. Yeah, this is not good. Oop, ouch. I'm thinking scum save. I'm thinking run. Thankfully it's just a laser rifle, so it's not really that powerful. Just fucking lasers. Uh we can catch our breath here for a second. Bottle caps, no. This is not the spot to be, is it? Uh. 
Okay, I think there's nothing else down here. Danger Fallout, I am the danger. Um, dirty water, that's a start. What else we got? Brock flowers? Oh yeah, that's right, I still got most of my shit here. Uh, I did the thing again. Hold on, we could do Dan's electronics though, because we don't have that many points in repair. Uh, see how far this gets us. Thank God that thing is just like stuck there and it's not coming after us. Also, what's our next? Uh, where's our next location supposed to be? Oh, that's really far away. If I can teleport back to the sink balcony, I think that's the that's the strat right there. Oh, you can't sell it? Ah, uh, that's a bummer. There's enemies nearby. No, there's not. Okay. Oh my gosh. There are. Maybe, maybe if I get it fast enough. No. I need... Fuck it. Oh yeah, you're right. Look at that. Breaking my own rules. I'm a rat bastard, aren't I? Alright, let's go, let's go. Fucking quick strats. Yeah, baby. Fortnite, train me right. A sip of Sprite. Lock tight. Come on. Oh my god. I just need to get far enough away to where I can get away from them. <laughs> Run, Walter. Could you imagine uh, Forrest Gump? but replace all the characters of uh, Breaking Bad characters. What a fucking, what a great movie that would have been. Oh, uh, we're not that far away from it, Ivor. Look, we're so close. Are we being shot at by the scorpion still? Doesn't sound like it anymore. Actually, I think we might be safe. I think we got away. Ah, uh, look at that. Beautiful. Might I be of service, sir? Uh... What do I need Very to good, sir. Oh my god. 322 caps to do that small repair. Would you believe that? <laughs> You're right. Oh man, combat armor is on the down. 10,000 caps to fix that though. Wow. No thank you, pal. Uh, my metal armor is also not in the best shape. Yeah, it was... Um, I mean, it was like a pseudo-happiness. Like, you knew things were going to get better, but the situation was... God, you wouldn't want to be in his situation. His shoes? Yikes, a Roonies. Where do I put... Where's the dock at? There he is. You require some additional... Sir do I need to... Concerned about the state of your mind, are you? Well, such things ain't my specialty, but I'm happy to tender my opinion as to your mental health. I should make you aware that the benefits of such a procedure are exclusive. That is, this only works once. Now, are you sure this is what you want? Yeah. The light switch... Where's the light switch at? What do you mean? 
foot bones connected to the leg bone. Leg bones. The second switch. Purple bone. Am I uh toward my room? Oh. Oh, okay. Light switch one. And light switch two is probably in here. Yeah, there it is. Uh, mm, that was a nice little uh, cat nap. How long was I out? Uh, listen, a light switch that turns me on. I must be dreaming. <laughs> oh, you. I bet you say that to all the light switches. Uh, only the sexy ones. Now I know you're flirting with me. And it's working. Why don't you take this? to remember me by. Uh, okay, well, I've... I've gotta go. Oh. Let's see. We need to get, uh, we need to get the other ones. That's the, that's the last part of this quest, isn't it? Hold on. The light switch in the jukebox, yeah. Okay, I see now. Alright, let's go get those really quick, and then, uh, we might, <sighs> let's see, if, hopefully we can do it. I think if we can get this done, like, the next 15-ish minutes, I'm gonna be a happy camper. I doubt it, though. Given the rest of this fucking run. Dude, <laughs> Jefferson. Oh, fuck. Uh, oop. The lobotomites got guns. Yikes. We should have came here with more money. I really should have strategized better. Oh, that's radioactive. I don't want to swim in that. Oh, those are big guttery noises. We're still pretty good on health, though. I'm not, uh... I'm not aching too hard yet. <clears throat> Pig's Village. This is like the one with, uh... The model room set up. It's like a TV stage. In it. Something like that. Or not like a TV stage, but it's like a preserved, like, neighborhood. Yeah, this is the one right here. I'm gonna jump on the roof only because I can. Actually, I wonder how many roofs I can jump from. Given how, like, absolutely broken jumping is in this game. Ayo, look at that. Oh, I don't want to pull anything over here. Ugh. There she is. Nothing useful. Something useful. There is a mini death clock. Wait a second. If I get down off the house, is the, the death clock going to attack me? I don't remember. I Oh, well, I guess we're going to fuck around and find out. No, I remember... Um, I remember that there is the death claw here. I just don't remember what it does. He doesn't like the fountain, though, you say. Is he back here? Ha! Ah! Christ, he scared the shit out of me there for a second. Also, isn't, like, the only way you can, uh... Oh. I think I went too far. Okay, so this is like not cool here, bro. Whoa, Nelly. He didn't hit that hard, did he? That was like just one single hit. Sonic emitter him? Does that do anything? Yeah, let's try that.
But it doesn't do like very much damage at all. Oops. Yeah, it's like barely making a scratch on his tight, delicate, ripped shoulders as he runs away. You're right, it is better than being killed. Oh my god. Hold on. I got a cheap shot moment right here. This is like total focus right here. <laughs> Leader of the Gremlins. Was he? Was that the name of the uh, the Gremlin? The top guy? I, I think the last time I watched that movie I was like 12. Oh sweet baby, did you see that? Beautiful. Oh, he had an egg timer on him. It's a uh, convenient storage on the Death Claw's body, so that way you can take their uh, Gabe. There's nothing in the doghouse. Stripe, Gabe on the floor. I, I remember that being like a reference to something. I, I don't remember what it was. Chicken leg. Quote unquote chicken leg. I wonder what it is. Hey, Nuka Cola Quartz. Let's take that. The bowl, you say, huh? Oh, Gabe's bowl. Okay, wait. Oh, let's see if you can find more evidence of Gabe in X8. This is for uh, one of the, the dudes, ain't it? The scientists. We need to go into this house, though. This is the mission that we're following. Yeah. This is, uh... Really reminiscent of that one mission from Fallout 3. Jukebox turns on. Who lived here? Uh, it was actually uh, George Washington's house growing up. Fun fact. Definitely, yeah. Uh, eight lived here. That jukebox turns on. That's, uh, that's something I don't understand about Fallout 4, is that there's a lot of instances where the power is out. But it's like, you know, these buildings, yeah, sure, it's been uh, torn down for a while, but the one right next door, the power is not out on that one, so. What's your fucking excuse, building, you know? Tons of bottle caps, not nearly enough for us though. Ooh, a turpentine, that's what we were looking for earlier.
they made him. Let's see. Find Geo Jefferson. What the fuck is that? Oh, he's a jukebox? I don't think there's anything else in here though. I'm looking around to see if maybe there's any like secret tapes or anything, but the file. You save is for him. Oh, okay. I think I get you. I really need to get that second cup of coffee in me, like, ASAP. Let's check out these other houses really quick. I didn't want that camera. Uh, I thought I saw a tape. <coughs> Man. Nothing in here. Some mint outs. <coughs> what the fuck is going on in here? <coughs> Was the science chick's house? Oh, yeah. She had some. Uh, she had some fucking issues with the teddy bears. I don't know. I'm not one to bash. I've got fucking. She, yeah, she was really fucking kinky. No, like that's the thing though. Is that, like I'm not one to fucking bash on people. I got like fucking the stuffed animal and shit like here. But as an adult, I use it more for like my back because I could put it back there on my lumbar. But I got tons of those little stuffed animals. Those things are so good for your your lumbar. I swear to God. I stand by it. Pre-war hat. We're going to grab that. Oh, here we go. Secret book. I don't know what my problem is. It's, it's 154. Yeah, you're right. That's what my fucking problem is. It's 154. I need to be like a normal human and get on a regular schedule. Oh, this is interesting. Look at this. Mr. House has got a few knives stuck in him. That's a neat little, uh, neat little tidbit there, isn't it? Another tape. Giant Tarantula, audio sample. Sonic emitter, take it to the jukebox in the sink to recalibrate the sonic emitter for new effects. What? Ha, what? Alright, I think that's all she wrote for up in here. Let's see what the next house is like. Uh, 
Oh, so actually, I think I'm gonna save the the after show for Saturdays. I I rewatched it last night, um, and I'm I, I just wasn't really happy with like how I performed, and I don't want to put bad content out there. Um, so I think uh, I think I'm gonna save that for the weekend, just on like Saturdays, just so I have a little more time throughout the week to kind of actually prepare. But this Saturday we're gonna be talking about uh, uh fuck what was his name Van. Uh, something. Fuck, I, his name is lost to me right now. It's the creator of uh, Johnny Bravo. We're, we're going to talk about his legacy and, and just, like, everything he's done for, uh, you know, like, where he came from, like, you know, where he got his start, how he started with animation. I, I, I think talking about, like, one specific genre instead of, like, trying to make it a broader term would, would make things better, you know? But tonight we're still doing, uh, oh, yeah, armor. Wait, hold on. Did I, was it in the box here? Um, so we're still doing a stream after tonight, uh, but it's gonna be Dr. Klein's glove. It's uh, we're, no, we're gonna play uh, we're gonna play old PlayStation Two, uh, Johnny or not Johnny Bob? What is it? Scooby Doo Night of a Hundred Frights? I got my my PlayStation all hooked up, so we're 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 rolling back our clocks to two thousand and eight. Yikes, did you see the price tag on that thing? This is the office, isn't it? Did I grab the armor? Oh, yeah, that's what I was looking for was the scrubs. Okay, I see now. Let's uh, let's press forward a bit. Mix up the location. No, that's all good. Uh, let's check out door to number. What was this door called? Door to number one. Number zero. If only I was paying attention a little more. Ooh, that's a good amount of battle caps. Can't be skipping out on that. This is Morbius's house. <coughs> Where he morbed. Mighty Morbin Morbius. There sure are a lot of bottle caps just kind of stashed around here and there. Yeah, there are a ton of Mentats in here. Too bad this is, uh... Oh, I think I wrote that down in the rules, try not to, to use drugs. Here it is. Alright. Uh... I think we got this one last house. Oh, they're house numbers. I see now. Okay. Uh-oh. That's spooky. Uh, I wonder what's down in there. I wonder if there's a, a key for down in there, actually. part is uh, finding it for wherever it is. Hold on. It can't be that hard to find. I mean, really. Oh. Yeah, see, what did I say? It's not that hard. I knew I could find it. My little birdie told me. Nice, nice clue. That's a good clue. What the fuck was that noise? Oop. There's another one right there. Oh, look at that. Alright, let's go see what's downstairs really quick. We'll, uh, we'll see what's downstairs, and then we'll take our quick intermission. <coughs> um, 
And then we'll be back with Scooby-Doo Night of 100 Frights. Uh, I think we'll take a couple days playing that. That's, that was one of my favorite games growing up, by the way. Uh, so I think we're going to have a lot of fun doing that. And I'll be a little more awake, a little more energized. You know, hula screw girl. Ooh. That's, uh, that's, that's kind of spooky. What the fuck is this, though? Hold on, this is Morbius' house. This is, like, fucked up down here. Now I'm kind of putting two and two together. Oh, you got a ripper. Electrical parts. Yikes. Can I get in the cage? No. Boris. Not Morbius. Yeah, you're right. Morbus. as Boris. Because Boris did that fucked up shit with the animals. Yeah. Uh, no, okay. Alright, well, I think that's it. I think we've seen it all. Hold on. Just poke our head in this one really quick. 108 was where we started, right? I love it, Richie Marcus. Yeah, alright, yeah. Let's, uh, let's put a save on this. So, yeah, let's take a quick intermission. I gotta go stretch my legs. I don't want to run out of too much time. Uh, stretch my legs, make some more coffee, and, uh, we'll be right back. Also, I want to make sure I've got this all hooked up yet. I haven't tested the PlayStation 2 to see if it's hooked in there right. And we're gonna do the PlayStation 2, the PS1, the, the original Xbox. I'm gonna try to get all the old consoles working up on this machine I got going here. So, um... Let me hit a save button again here real quick, just to make sure, and we'll be right back. Stay tuned. We're going to have lots of fun reliving the happy days.